Topic one of the dream subject for all international students scholarships. It's, it's a dream topic how to apply how many are available in the UK for international students. <laughs> Nihao Kemcho, wherever you are, this is your host Jessica from my YouTube channel Civil Engineer. For those who are new to my channel, my name is Jessica. I'm a civil engineering design consultant working in the UK for the past 15 years. I provide guidance, assistance, and help to civil engineers as well as to the students. If you need help with civil engineering or immigration to the UK as a student, please use the comment section below and I'll be happy to answer your queries there. Guys, today's topic, one of the dream subjects for all international students, well, not even international, but the home students as well, scholarships. It's, it's a dream topic, anyone here wants the scholarships, but how to apply, how many are available in the UK for international students, that's all I'm going to discuss in this video, so make sure you watch the whole video to get the most out of this video. But, how many are available? 1680 something like that well it will come later on yeah in the video but before i start right a, a, a big request from yourselves uh, there has been a debate and comments about whether i do my uh, videos in english urdu or pashto or whatever arabic uh, uh, whatever you want i need your assistance in that so you I, I need your comments here yeah? in the comment section you need to show me your preference whether you want me to to talk about in the video completely English or completely Hindi or Urdu or you want a mixture of both so that, that would be really helpful information for me to tell my video accordingly obviously it's, it's for your yourselves I mean if you are happy with with the with the language I'm, I'm talking about uh, that's that's all I need so I need to tell the videos the future future video based on the uh, actually the consensus you're gonna tell me in in the comment section below all you need to do is just type into the comment what your preference is. Is it English, Urdu or both? Uh, yeah, both means yeah, I can talk uh, basically a mixture. Urdu may be bad karunga, English may be don't know mixture karke aap ke saath ya share karunga. So yeah, the, the more consensus, the, the more words yeah, I'm getting. So I'm going to make sure uh, to, to basically provide you that, that sort of video in the future. Right, coming back to the main topic of the video, the scholarship in the, in, in the UK for the international students. Study in the UK is an excellent opportunity for all the students for higher education. It's, it's a dream come true for every student in the UK, uh, but obviously it doesn't come cheap. You need a financial aid, definitely. Yeah, I mean to support yourself, and I would say majority of the students they they just postpone their plans, everything, the higher education because of the financial aid. But that's that's where yeah, I'm I'm sharing these scholarships. There are plenty yeah, in thousands of scholarships they are available here in the UK, and I'm sure if you are the the one of the top students here out there, even not even the top students, if you are an every student like myself, I used to be, uh, you can still avail the opportunity. It doesn't need to be full bursary, but at least yeah, you can apply for the partial scholarship, and that's exactly what I'm sharing in this video. Not just the fully scholarship, but also yeah, the partial scholarship which every student can apply uh, in, in, in the UK and that is, I mean, every little help, I mean, if you get a little bit of help with your financial aid, with your financial fee, that's exactly what I'm trying to, to save you from this video. If you watch the whole video, you will know exactly how to apply and how to avail the opportunity to, to release the pressure on your financial. Well, obviously it depends, uh, it depends, yeah, what scholarship you are applying for. Uh, if you're applying for a good and generous, yeah, the full bursary scholarship, the competition is quite high. And uh, if you're going for the lower, the, the uh, partial scholarship, uh, it becomes yeah quite normal for, for, for the students. This is for sure, I mean, every scholarship requires your previous academic record. So if you have a good academic record, there's no way you, you, you should th think twice, just apply for it. That, that's the best advice I can give right, you. Guys, so here I'm sharing the four best uh, international scholarship available for the students, for the international students in the UK. Uh, it will start from the uh, completely the, the full bursary 
that covers the uh, uh, everything from from the fee to the accommodation and even the stipends as well. Uh, that, that is a dream for every student. But as I said, I mean, if, if you're going for the higher one, you need to be really from, from yeah, outside from the crowd. You, you need to be on top of the crowd. That's where you can avail that, uh, that uh, scholarship. But there are some which I'm going to talk about, yeah, uh, later in the in the video, which I, I believe, yeah, every student can, can just apply for it. And I'm sure you will get some benefit out the of that. The first scholarship I'm talking about here is the full bursary. Uh, it's called the Shivening Scholarship. Uh, it's provided by the UK government and the candidates are selected by the British councils in individual countries and it's open to all all over the world basically anyone can apply for that but you need to be really on top of the on, on top of the game basically to apply for it you need to be quite good at your academic and you, you have the qualities I mean to apply for it every year there are 1500 uh, Shivani scholarships they are offered uh, in each uh, in each academic year that that is the the number of scholarships that they are offered to the international students to come full bursary that that uh, f completely uh, to to do your MSc one year MSc course in the UK that includes yeah the fee plus the accommodation as well that's a dream. The second scholarship is the Eurex UK. Uh, it's for the PhD students, for the researchers. Again, this is funded by the British Council and uh, anyone can apply for it. But obviously, if you are a PhD, not the master students, it covers the, uh, the, the research, the whole research free. Uh, basically, it covers the, the cost of all your research, but the accommodation is not free. So you have to pay for your accommodation. The research is completely free, whatever the length is, whether it's a one year, two year or complete completely five years research that is free as well. And the third scholarship that is available for all the international students is the Commonwealth Scholarship. And uh, throughout the world, wherever, yeah, Commonwealth, really the, the Asian countries, they all come into the Commonwealth countries. So you are eligible for this uh, scholarship. There's a huge number of your people come on, the, on this scholarships basically, and that covers MSc, one year MSc plus the PhD courses as well and the, the, the primarily the, the students the selection is made based on your previous academic record if you have a good academic record don't shy to get into the, this, this scholarship it's only for the studies so you have again to pay for your residency your scholarship is the UK University scholarship that's the one I'm talking about actually it's open to any international students, anyone can apply for it. And it's, it's completely based on the your academic record. Also, the, the university does account for your your English language as well in full bursary, not fully funded, but they are partial scholarships. So you got yeah from different university, they got yeah different partial scholarships ranges from one thousand to up to four thousand pounds basically from, from your fee. And as I said, I mean this is completely based on your academic record. Uh, this is quite easy process when you apply for the admissions at that stage you can you can search for the scholarship and you need to make sure you apply for these scholarships these are quite easy you don't need to do any additional research or anything I mean it's included in your uh, application process already so all you got to do is uh, make sure you you research the, the university you're applying for there will be on their website there will be fee and funding uh, section on in the top menu you need to click there and check the scholarships available for the international students. This is quite common and I, I must add here, I was one of the lucky, I mean, to get the 2000 scholarship back in the days, long time ago. But that was good enough actually for me at the time and uh, I had the 2000 all from Belfie. And you feel the pleasure, you feel, yeah, you definitely feel the pleasure, I mean, when you get, yeah, the scholarship, even if it's a little as £500, at least, yeah, nothing to lose. So you, you are in the best place. So these are the four different types of scholarships. They are available for the international students. But I must say, you need to check yourself, basically. I will uh, I will add the links in into the description below. You need to click on the links and uh, check yourself. I mean, if you are eligible for, for these scholarships, don't shy, I mean, to apply for them. Just go for it. I mean, that's the only way you can avail them. Otherwise, yeah, I mean, it's, it's not gonna come on your door. So you need to make sure you apply for them. Guys, I hope this uh, video is useful. Uh, and if you think so, don't forget to click the uh, uh, like and subscribe button. 
for more informative and educational videos. Thanks for watching. Thank you.